Hello and welcome back everybody to City Skylines. It's not snowfall. I think I may have said snowfall in the last episode. It's after dark. I got so used to saying snowfall from doing the snowfall series. But hey, we're in after dark here and wow, we're making this new area which should be pretty good once we're done. And I'm just going to uh, plop some trees down in between this area and the highway. That way these people, well, that way they actually have some kind of nice thing to look at instead of the highway and then the people on the highway have something nice to look at except for the buildings that way everybody loves looking at trees and forest I mean come on you can go out hiking and look at the trees all damn day they're just crazy huge things well not in this game there should be a mod though that lets you put like redwood trees we're like Zoomed in so far enough we can hear all of the chatter of the people that live in this city and they're like super loud <laughs> Probably not that loud on your red the, We got locked a bunch of cool new stuff. It seems it seems like there's been an update Which happened in between recording sessions for me and I started recording last episode And it seems to be really cool so far like there's these rock things we can put down. Oh That's the budget. We don't want to mess with that See, like, there's these rocks we can put down. Some cool stuff like this. If we can fit it in, I don't think we can. No, we can fit, like, these rocks in, though. Which I think are pretty cool. We can make, like, a, a signature signature rock formation. Oh! Boomtown, baby! Hell yeah! 3,000 people! Recreational use. We'll be doing that right away. We unlocked a new area to purchase. Bus, transport, uh, couldn't have come at a better time because our city is growing. A bunch of new things, a highway, oh, a bunch of new roads, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. A cemetery, which is probably the first thing we're going to have to put down. But besides that, I was trying to put some rocks down because they look really cool. They do. They look really nice. And we can put some trees down as well to kind of cover them in a way. So we'll put like a tree or two here, maybe one here as well, and a couple this way. Same for this. It makes it look really nice. Just kind of, kind of hide them in trees. That looks so cool. It looks really cool. I love tree lining uh, off the highway. It just looks nice. It really does. Okay, so we unlocked the cemetery, which we're going to have to put down. I think I said I was about to put down a, well, I was about to put down a fire station somewhere. Where can we put this cemetery? We're probably going to put it, well, over here somewhere, I think. I would like to put it this way. Or maybe we can put it on this road. Possibly. I don't know. People coming in off the highway, I don't think the first thing they want to see is a cemetery. Even though people in this game seem to love cemeteries, we'll put it... Let's see. Let's plan ahead a bit. Let's get a road going this way and a road going this way. Because we want the cemetery to be big enough to hopefully fit... A crematorium next to it if not that's fine as well we'll have it right there which should be good the crematorium can go this way which should be nice okay that works out pretty well we can do with some trees next to it but we won't worry about that right away uh, let's get this road to come out a bit more perfect and we'll have this road come out some more as well it just to leave that like that for the future our neighborhood here seems to be filling in pretty nicely and well we didn't get to dame our neighborhood yet, which is pretty interesting. We haven't done it. Something we can also do is, well, name this big road, which I like to name these big roads and then put a heavy traffic ban on them. That way we can shit. That way we can actually dumb down on the traffic because the industry will, well, it will cause a lot of traffic. Strawberry Square. No, it's not. It's party lane. How about that? Party lane. <laughs> Everything's going to be doing with party. Okay? So far, no policies. What we can do in the policy zone is we can do a smoking ban and recreational use. Hell yeah. And I think that's about it for right now. So the whole country or whatever, this whole land, is all about, well, partying. Partying pretty hard. There's a recreational use in effect, and, <laughs> well, pretty much everyone can do whatever they want at the moment, because we can't really do too much more, per se, with the policies. 
and I just messed up that district a little bit more. <laughs> I just noticed that. It's fine. We can go back and fix it. We're just going to make this a district here, and we'll make this other neighborhood a district, and then we'll name them. What I'm going to name them, I don't have a clue, and I realize that I'm going to mess up this road yet again <laughs> by doing this, by making this neighborhood. <laughs> every time, every time it seems, it gets messed up. It's a real pain in my side. Uh, let's see, we could probably do that. See, like, it just, it just doesn't know. It doesn't know that there's a district there and it covers it. It's really weird. Okay, so we'll continue on. We'll come out a little bit like this because we'll probably put houses there eventually. And we should be golden like that. Golden just like the Golden Girls. Which, fun fact, they're not actually made of gold. Which was a big disappointment when I first watched them. Can we come out even further? I think we can. Okay, we'll come out this far. <laughs> we'll come out as far as we can out of the zone. Okay, brilliant. That looks good. Districts are in place. Now we just have to, well, name them. Um, well, this is where you work. So, I forget office space. We'll put office space. <laughs> That's usually what I name something where a lot of people go to work. And then this will be something kind of like, what's a good party, party acronym? Does anyone know? <laughs> I'm asking like I can get some answers or something. I really can. Uh, <laughs> something you do at parties. How about this? Uh, pin the tail <laughs> on the donkey. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why. It's just the first thing I could think of. Pin the tail on the donkey. Yeah, there we good. There we go. That's good. That's real good. Okay. So we have our cemetery in place. Something I was going to do is we'll put another fire station down. We have a pretty high chance of fires happening. What we can do is we can have a fire station in the middle of this commercial zone, which I think should help. Maybe on the main road here like that. Already, our fire hazard should be going down. It's at 39%. Well, 30. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing really great. Okay, what to do next? We unlocked buses. And I think over here in this zone is where we're going to put our buses. Now we kind of want our buses to come out on the main road here. Well, actually, let me save the game first real quick. Because <laughs> I'm never too sure if the game will crash or not now. And I'm scared. Save often, save early. Or is it the other way around? Something we have been forgetting to do is buy another sector of land, which I'm going to buy right now. And we want to get to this coast. We're pretty much there now. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like beelining for the coast because I really want to get over here. We really want that water access, and it seems like we could probably put industrial over here. We could make this an industrial zone, which should fit pretty well. And there's some palm trees in the ground. That's probably my fault. But there's some nice beaches over there where we can have some awesome parties. So we'll probably go to the left from this way out, which is pretty nice. And we shouldn't take too long to get there. Oh, I can't wait. I love building cities and then just seeing everything come together. Okay, so I was saying I want the buses to kind of come out onto the main road here. So I think what we could do is we can actually... Can we fit a road behind? No, we cannot. I was going to try and fit a road behind the good old cemetery maybe like that that's probably fine enough I'll have a road come out like that the cemetery will kind of have its own secret area and we want our buses to have their own one-way lane out so what we'll do here is we'll have a road come off like this and then we'll have a one-way oh, we're gonna go over the path which is pretty bad we'll get rid of it for now because I don't think we'll use it We'll use it for here, which is pretty nice, but not for anywhere else. So we'll have a one-way road come out for the buses, which is going to be good. So we will... Is that the bulldozer? Um, trying to bulldoze the power lines, which is a no-no. Everything doing well? Okay. <laughs> I figured something would have been happening by now. Like maybe I cut a power line or something. So we'll have the buses. I think we could probably have them come out like this. Well... What I like to do is set up a zone full of buses, and you know me, so 
I think we'll have another one-way street here. This is kind of where our transportation is going to be, which is pretty nice. So, I think what we can do is we can have some buses. We can have a bus right here in the middle, and maybe we can put some parks around it. There we go. That's like perfectly in the middle, which is nice. So, what we can do is we'll have bus stops, like three, along this main portion of the road here. And maybe some nice parks and stuff, which should help the local... Uh, community of people so we'll get our water pipe out because they seem to need it there we go and since this is a one way it's going to cut down on people coming down this way and getting in the trucks in the buses way which is really good so first and foremost well we can also do a taxi a taxi place so we'll get a taxi set up so people can actually call the taxi and have a, a different way home if they need be so we'll put two taxi stands here because I feel like this city might get pretty busy and we can make our own custom parks here too as well so this is great first of all we need well we can do trams I've never done trams that's something I've yet to explore first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a residential line which is going to come straight over here and try and hit as many of the neighborhoods as it possibly can. Uh, I think what we can do is come down like this road. Can we try and make them equal? We can. Look at this. Okay, we'll do this. And then we will... Does that connect right there? It does. Can they, can they not come down this road? Okay, they'll go like that. They'll stop at Party Square, which is pretty nice. They'll come back around and they'll just hit the other side of Party Square. Okay, we're doing pretty well already. And we will just try to make this as even as possible. And we should be nice and even at this point with the bus stops, which I think are pretty good. <clears throat> oh, pardon me. I think are pretty good. And then we'll come here next and try and hit most of this neighborhood. Uh, we'll probably stop here first and then turn and keep turning. Oh, this is great. I love planning this kind of stuff out. And then we'll come back around to the outside. Well, I think we want to try and avoid... Oh, here we go. We can stop in the cul-de-sac area. And then come back out. Come back in. And then uh, we can come back out again. <laughs> These people are going to have buses go all over the place in their neighborhood. But if you don't notice, people love buses in this game. They just love them. And then we'll come back and stop right there. So that could be the residential line. And we will now name it. Well, I think what we can do is we'll click on the bus. And we can modify the line. And now we can change the color. We're going to have to pause the game. I like to make them green so I know that they're for residential. Because residential in this game are, well, green. Did we? Is this to modify the bus name? I don't know. <laughs> How about the, the party train? The party train line. I think that should be good because most of these people are, well actually no, no maybe not. How about um, party picker uppers? <laughs> I think that should work pretty well because this is going to go pick up the partiers. So it's the party picker uppers line and it's day and night. How about that? I've got some ideas for the good old party line in the future. We can possibly, I don't know, do um, a single line that hits all the party spots, possibly. So, we started making buses, which I think is pretty neat. It's really cool. So, we'll continue on making more bus routes next time. I thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.